Hi, this is George Swift from Bigger Bites Bold, the mindset for success, time and money. So often I hear this from everybody, but especially from small business entrepreneurs, small business owners, especially the micro businesses, the solopreneurs, for example. Time and money, time and money. It's the number one reason that people struggle to develop themselves. It's the number one reason that people will struggle to, say, buy any of my products or join my groups. It's probably the number one reason that a lot of people don't necessarily buy your services or your products, depending on what you do. You'll hear it over and over again, I don't have enough time, I don't have enough money. The truth of the matter is, what you're really saying is that you don't see the value of spending the time and money on it. If you're already spending all your money, if you are, most people aren't, but if you are, and if you're already using all your time, all that's happening is your unconscious mind is prioritizing what's important for you to spend money and spend your time on. So of course, we can reprioritize that. Now how this works in terms of you actually selling to your customer base or selling your services, for example, is you have to understand your customers having the same thing going on inside their heads. They do have time, they do have money because they're spending it all on something. They're just not willing to spend it on you or your services or your products. So the challenge for you, of course, is, is to work out within your client what is it that's going to make that a priority for them because if you make it a priority for them, they will find the time and they will find the money if they can. So time and money is always an excuse, inverted commas, but I know it's very real as well. Because of course, if you don't have any money, how can you find extra money? The truth is, you always find extra money for those things that are really important and are really high on your own priorities. So, think about this for your own perspective. If there's things out there that are gonna develop you, things that are gonna make life better for you, things that you maybe just need to do for yourself, but you're not prioritizing them, don't be surprised that they're not falling down the priority stack and therefore they're not happening and keep saying, I don't have time, I don't have money, is never gonna get them up. It's never also gonna change the status quo. It's just a statement of fact. I don't have time, I don't have money, which means it's gonna keep on perpetuating. What you need to look for is really simple, priorities. What are my priorities? And if this is really a priority for me, I have to get the message into my own unconscious mind that this is important, it's a priority for me, and therefore we need to find the time and money. Once you start doing this on yourself, you will start being able to work it out for your customers and for your clients. Don't ever take the stuff that I share with you and immediately say, right, I'm gonna go out there all ninja, or I'm gonna go out there like a Jedi and use all this mind stuff on everyone else. No, master it in your own life, master it for yourself, and then you'll be able to apply it to other people. Then you'll be able to apply it to your families and to your business uh, colleagues and associates, to your clients and everything else. First of all, do it for yourself, understand the process. When you understand the process of what makes you tick, then you'll understand what makes everyone else tick, and then you'll be able to apply that in your business or in your life. So, don't ever accept, I don't have enough time or money from yourself, because if you do, then you're always gonna accept it from your clients, and it's the number one reason that I'm almost guaranteeing that people don't buy your services or your products. Until next time, be successful.